Hey guys, welcome to Define Agile. My name is Anatoly and we're talking all things Agile today. We're going to talk about how to create a sprint backlog. But before we do two things, if you're just starting out with Jira, it's very complicated. You can be confused. I have two options for you right away. Apart from watching all the videos I have online, you can go to the description for this video at get my help section. And there are a couple of things I can help you with. There are course, you can learn Jira from basic to advanced in about one day. It's very, very affordable. You will love it. Second one is you can schedule time with me or someone in my team and we can walk you through all your problems. Like if you have some issues, you start out and then you get very, very confused. Well, you can schedule time with us. We can help. So check it out as well. And now let's get to the point of this video, how to create a sprint backlog. So I'm going to start from scratch. I'm going to create a scrum project. So I'm going to start from scratch because to have a sprint, you need to be in Scrum. If you're in Canva or anywhere else, you cannot create a sprint backlog. So that might already help you out. But if not, you go to projects, you create a project. So we're going to just create quickly a Scrum project. I'm sure you know how to do all of this. You click on Scrum, you click use template. And here you can select Either it's a match by your team or by Jira admins. Let's say Jira admins. It's a lot of a lot of a lot of things they asked me to do. Uh, the project day would be sprint backlog video. Sprint backlog video. Create. All right. You already have active sprint board, which is where it goes when uh, you put your start your sprint and you have a backlog. So your backlog doesn't have anything and it's just a backlog. So let's create an issue in a backlog. What if, as I think you want to do it, what if I want to create a sprint, not make it active, but have a backlog put in a backlog, spring backlog, and just let it sit there and wait for me to create more tickets. How do I do that? You click on create sprint and don't be afraid. Just click on it. See, it didn't ask me to start it anything. It just created a sprint backlog. So now you can drag and drop this here and it's not started until I click start sprint. I can create more. So this is my second spring backlog. I can create another issue. Click test two. Put it here. So now I can pre-fill them. And when I'm ready, I'm going to start one at a time. And then they're going to go. So I just showed you how to create two spring backlogs. Hope it helped. If you think they brought you value, please like and subscribe. If you want to comment as well, if you have any questions, please do that as well. I really, really appreciate you watching. And I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.